Wendy Williams' pals are concerned about the influx of new people into her life. Wendy Williams' friends are concerned about her new company. Wendy doesn't have many true pals, but the handful that are showing up are raising some anxiety for those who actually care about her, a source told Page Six. The big worry is when she has guests around her house, the person continued. She owns a lot of jewelry and luxury purses. Williams is selling her personal items at her NYC apartment, according to Page Six. Wendy isn't in the best of spirits, so people will take advantage of that, a source informed us. Williams was in rehab for two months last year for therapy after relapsing from alcohol and other health issues. Williams' spokeswoman told Page Six exclusively that she is drinking alcohol again because she is celebrating a fresh lease on life. She is delighted and wanted to celebrate her new lease on life, her representative stated of a recent night out. She was pictured drinking at the Power Dining Fresco by Scotto in Manhattan in March before heading to the homosexual hangout The Townhouse. As Page Six exclusively reported, a lonely Williams was caught telling her group that she was going to get drunk at the popular eatery. Page Six also just confirmed that the former TV host is planning to relocate to Los Angeles and is currently emptying out her apartment. Wendy is getting rid of items for spring cleaning, which is what people do this time of year. Williams' rep informed Page Six of her housing predicament. Wendy is starting a new chapter in her life, and she is looking for new experiences. This is a typical gesture, and Wendy is no exception. Wendy is incredibly lonely right now, and that combination, plus her large bankroll, is not a healthy combination, a source said. Nobody comes to the table with good intentions. This many people would never have been near her back in the day, let alone at the same time. In 2022, Page Six reported that Williams had checked into rehab for substance abuse difficulties. She returned home after over two months of treatment, saying she was better than ever. The former daytime talk show host has several projects in the works, her rep has said, including a podcast and a potential new series.